What's going on, Hit Squad? It's your main man, Hitman, and I am back. Once again, with the daily spawn updates for Red Dead Redemption 2 Online, this is for the family heirlooms, all lost jewelry, the coins, the arrowheads, the flowers, the antique alcohol bottles, all tarot cards, the bird eggs, and the fossils. Today is Friday, March 19th, and as I say each and every video, Smash that thumbs up button if you find this video any bit informative or helpful in any type of way. And if you're watching, just browsing, just checking out the cycles, just checking out the channel, or me in general, <laughs> make sure you guys subscribe and hit that notification bell because I post videos each and every day. These videos are, are of other games and all this stuff like that because this is not just a Red Dead Redemption channel. Um, if you guys want to know Madame Nazar's location any bit earlier than this video, be sure to follow me on Instagram and Twitter at HitmanMiyagiYT because I do post her location as soon as she switches and any other information that I have for you guys for the channel. So follow me there. <laughs> um... Speaking of Madame Nazar, let's get to Madame Nazar's location, which today she is down here. Right in, I call it the Rio Bravo um, area. That's where I place my camp because I think Rio Bravo is like, like this part right here. All that, like how to see all that dotted line right there. All that is real, real Bravo, so. Place your camp in Rio Bravo. Well, that's how I personally get to her when she's in this area. Because it's it's kind of far from a fast travel, which the fast travel is here. Here, if I'm not mistaken, like right here. But it's way too far. You have too far to run. But where my camp is, see, that's perfect. I just did a beeline directly from my camp to her. Super easy to get to her. But place your camp in Rio Bravo. You make a do gap tooth bridge and see if we can get somewhere down here. But Rio Bravo, Rio Bravo is the area. Uh, she will be there until 2 a.m. That's Eastern Standard Time, New York Time Zone, East Coast Time Zone, for those of you who don't know or not of America. Let's get to our next thing, which is the Caribbean rum. Today, the Caribbean rum is in Blackwater, as you see, right here inside this camp. You see there's three little squares right here inside this tent right here. This is where you will find your real Bravo antique alcohol bottle for today. Let's get over here to where we usually do handle, handle business. Right here at this location, I'm going to put everything and frame so you guys can see everything. But the cycles for today, Friday, March 19th, are Family Heirloom Cycle 4, All Lost Jewelry Cycle 4, Coin Cycle 4, Arrowhead Cycle 4, Wildflower Cycle 4, Antique Alcohol Bottle Cycle 4, All Terra Card Cycle 4, Bird Egg Cycle 6, and Fossil Cycle 5. Yes, everything is Cycle 4 except the bird eggs and the fossils. So, I mean, if you need any more assurance, remember to check the description box below because everything will be down there. The cycles, a link to a video for the current cycle of fossils and how to spell my Twitter and Instagram name. Uh, let's get to the things we will find across this side of the map. Um, I want to start up here. Well, I usually start out all the way up at the top, like, I mean, you know, the utmost situation and work my way down. But, I mean, we're going to do that regardless. Right here, at this marker right here, between the M&A and Marsh, is a fossil. This is a random fossil. I cannot tell you guys which one you will get. Come over here with your metal detector, and that's what it is, a fossil. Um, let's go over here a little bit because we're closer to this area right here next to Harriet over here in the corner along 
the shoreline, there's a couple of trees right here, like two or three trees. Right between those trees and the shoreline, you will find a random arrowhead. Come over here with your metal detector as well. And that's what you will get. Uh, let's see what else. There's also a cardinal flower over here. I think right next to Harriet. So check that out as well. It may be like right here. I'm not 100% sure, but there's a cardinal flower over there as well. Um, on this porch of this house, you will find a Eight of Cups tarot card. So go get that. If you're over here in the time between 10 p.m. and 5 a.m., you will get a blood flower right here. So if you guys are over here in that area, come over here to this island and see if that spawns for you guys. It, it has to be between the time of 10 p.m. and 5 a.m. <laughs> Can't just randomly come over there and think it's going to spawn. But on to the next thing. Inside this house, I have a tarot card for you guys right here. Right inside this house or shack, there's a King of Swords tarot card. It's inside the shack on the table to the right. So go get that. Um, let's see what else we have. Over here to our next marker, let's go to this one. Right here inside this shack, exactly at that location, there's a, a bench. And on that bench, you will, you will find a goat hairbrush right here at this location, right inside this L-shaped shack. Go inside here directly to the back and right there on the right side of the shack, you will find your goat hairbrush. This goat hairbrush is a family heirloom. Let's go over here a little bit to our next location, our next marker. And at this next marker, you will find a bird egg. This bird egg is in a tree. Shoot it down with a varmint rifle or a bow using a small game arrow. This bird egg is an egret egg, E-G-R-E-T. Let's go up a little bit to our next marker, which is a coin. This coin is right here, about at this location. It may be up a little bit, like right here. I'm not 100% sure. It's right over here in this area. I try to mark it like according to this. Like, because I know it's above that a little bit. So right there. But <laughs> right here at this location, you will find the coin. So come over here with your metal detector by the tree. The base of that tree. That's where you will find your coin. Uh, let's go down to our next marker, which is inside the cemetery. Right here at this location inside this crypt. You will find a Benais Topaz ring. B-A-N-A-I-S is inside the crypt at this exact location. Go inside past the gate. And there's like a place where you can sit like candles and stuff. Grab it off of there. There you go. There's also a tarot card right about here inside the cemetery as well. This tarot card is a two of swords tarot card. There's also... A tarot card about right here. This tarot card, I think it's right here. Like over a little bit. Right here at this location, you will find a tar another tarot card, which is a Knight of Cups. It's on a box with a sheet hanging next to it. And there's another tarot card at our next marker, which is right here in this corner. This tarot card is sitting on a box near a fountain with a light. The fountain with the light is like right here. So the box is right there in the corner. And that tarot card is a four of cups. So go get that as well. On to our next marker, which is right next to the D and Denise. Right here at this location, there's a there's a gate right here. Go through the gate and on that table, that's on the other side of that gate is a ivory hairpin. This ivory hairpin is a family heirloom, so go get that as well. Um, there's another spot right here that has, <clears throat> like, in the backyard of this house, there's, like, um, patio furniture, like, white patio furniture and stuff like that. And on the table of this white patio furniture, 
you will find a cherry wood comb, which is another family heirloom. Um, let's see what else we have. Let's go down here to our next marker, which is right here. And if you know this marker, this is the antique alcohol bottle. This antique alcohol bottle is underground. So how you get this antique alcohol bottle? Go through the gate that's right here. There's a platform here. Get on, hop on top of that platform to your right, which it should be right here, should be a, an entrance that looks like it's into the building that, that leads you into the building, but it leads you down and around underground, like kind of where, like how my, my marker is. It leads you down and around underground right here to this location, to this bottle. When you get about here, you should see a crate a big crate underground with a lantern on it and an antique alcohol bottle. This antique alcohol bottle <coughs> is a Tennessee whiskey bottle. So go get that. Once you grab the bottle, just hit reverse. Go the other way, the same back way you came. Get out and let's go to this next marker, which is right here. This next marker is the cardinal flower that spawns over here in this area that helps me indicate exactly what cycle the cardinal flowers or the flowers are on. Uh, let's go to this next marker, which is a r random arrowhead. This random arrowhead is by a base, by the base of a tree in this area. There's a very, I don't want to call it a very large tree, but a, there's a larger tree over here in this area. Come over here with your metal detector and that's what you will get, a random arrowhead. Let's see what else we have for you guys. Um. There's a couple things in roads, like uh, tarot cards. There's two tarot cards in roads. There's a tarot card here, which is a six of cups. And there's a tarot card inside the little room on the side of this building or house. There's a nine of pentacles tarot card on a work table inside that little room right here. There's a little tiny room right there. Go inside there and get that Ten of Pentacles. There's also a random lost jewelry right here at this location next to a big rock. Come over here with your metal detector and that's what you will get. A random lost jewelry. Let's go over to our last marker that I have marked, which is inside this the Matic Pond house. Right here at this location. Uh, in a chest in the bedroom, or one of the bedrooms, you will find a New Guinea Rosewood airbrush. This New Guinea Rosewood airbrush is a family heirloom, so go get that as well. Um, that's pretty much it that I have for you guys for the extras. But, if you guys did not hear me before, the cycles for today once again are, or Friday, March 19th, are... Everything cycle four, except bird eggs and fossils. <laughs> but family heirloom cycle four, all lost jury cycle four, coin cycle four, arrowhead cycle four, flowers, wildflowers, antique alcohol bottles cycle four, wildflowers are four, all tarot cards four, bird eggs six, fossils five. Once again, Family Heirloom Cycle 4, All Lost Jewelry Cycle 4, Coin Cycle 4, Arrowhead Cycle 4, Wildflower Cycle 4, Antique Alcohol Bottle Cycle 4, All Tarot Card Cycle 4, Bird Egg Cycle 6, and Fossils Cycle 5. Remember to check the description box below because everything will be down there. The cycles, a link to a video for the current cycle of fossils, and how to spell the name of my Twitter and Instagram for the channel. There will not be any extras. I won't be posting memes or anything like that. That doesn't have anything to do with games. But it's a game channel. Any type of information that I have, have for you guys with the channel until I hit a thousand. That's where I will put out the information. Um, a thousand subscribers. Um, thank you guys for like, sharing, sub subscribing, commenting, talking with me. And all that other stuff. I didn't get to say that yesterday because baby was singing. But <laughs> I do appreciate each and every one of you. Um, it's your main man, Hitman. And I'm out.